Appreciate y'all for tuning in. But before we get started, make sure you like and subscribe to my channel so you get a notification every time I go live or drop a video. I appreciate it. This critical incident community briefing is intended to provide you with information about an officer-involved shooting incident that occurred on September 12th, 2022 in the 1600 block of Nielsen Street in the city of Utica. On September 12th, 2022, at 7.49 p.m., Utica police officers were dispatched to 1601 Nielsen Street in the city of Utica for an emotionally disturbed person call for service. The male informed the 911 call taker that he was armed with weapons to include rifles and a knife. You are about to see and hear audio files and body-worn camera video so that you can have a better understanding of what transpired based on the facts that we know now. In the first audio file, you will hear the male, Mr. David Litz, in his own words speaking to the 911 operator. Please be advised that some of what you will hear and see will be disturbing, and any time an officer uses force, it can be graphic and unsettling to some. In addition, there may be strong language used by those shown in the video. Viewer discretion is advised. 911, address of emergency. Yes, uh, I am suicidal. What is your address, sir? 1601 Nielsen Street, Utica, New York. Repeat your address to make sure I have a correct? I've been through a bad time. I've been through a bad time. You know, I don't even know. I want to put a gun to my mouth. Do you have access to a weapon, sir? Yes, I do. What kind 22. of weapon do you have? You have a twenty-two. I have a twenty-two. Yep. Where is that twenty-two now? Uh, yeah, I threw it in the basement, trying to get off. Believe me, I just want to fucking die, man. Hold on, sir. What is your name? Six, uh, uh, Dave, and it's 1601 Nielsen Street, Utica. Dave, what is your I, last name? I cannot take this. I have long-term COVID, and it's killing me. David, what is your last name? I don't know. L I T T S. I need to get out of here because I threatened my wife with a gun. You threatened your wife with a gun? Yes, to get out of my house. I don't want to live no more. Okay, David, I'm sorry. I can will, I have Dave? Can I have your last I name will one more kill time? Please? A police officer. I don't care. David, can I have your last name, please? Why do you want my last name for? I'm going to die. You said your 22 Maybe. is in the basement, David? It, it's thrown out the backyard, okay? okay. So is it I in the backyard that. or but is it in the basement? There is going to be something damaged. I'm going to eat everything in this house that's fucking poisonous. I'm going to eat the fucking pills. I don't give a fuck. I don't care if you feel or not. Sorry. David, how many dogs do you... There we go. A hundred different pills. Uh, fuck you. David, I'm can you dying. come outside? I ain't gonna kill. No, no, I'm a veteran. I don't give up. David, can you come outside, please? Well, well you don't know me. David, what you are you up. doing? I'm swallowing about a hundred pills. David, can you walk outside, please? If I walk outside, I got a shotgun. Okay. You have a shotgun now? No, I won't use it. Oh, David, do you have a shotgun or not? <laughs> what do you wish? What do you wish? Uh -huh. Who cares? I don't give a God damn no more, okay? I suffered David. for three fucking years, and Three fucking years of fucking COVID. David, okay? can you please walk outside with your hands up and talk to and the no, officer that's there? No, I won't. I'm going to kill somebody. 
I will never walk out. You want to fucking kill me? My my fucking wife just left me. You know, 31 years of fucking shit. Ah! I don't care. You want to get me? Get me, okay? But I'm going to kill somebody on the way out. I'm tired of it, man. I served this country. Everything else has no help. No help. No help. You want to come out and fire at me? I got some David. fucking M16 in here. David. No, I will kill. I will kill these son of a bitches. What? Yeah, well, look, the pussies aren't here. The pussies aren't here. No. Motherfucker, let's go. Let's go. It's party time. Fuck you. Come on, David. pussy. It's party time. You will die. You will die. Get out of here. I'm going to kill you. Give me my shit. Give me my shit. David. I am not going to cooperate. I want them to kill me. I need death. Okay? If you can't understand that shit... That's good, because now it's time. I I want to die. I want to die. Come on, motherfuckers. You can't even get me. Motherfucker. Come on. David. Where are you at? Where are you at, you fucking pussy? Come on and shoot me. Come on, you rotten bastard. Come on. And you look up police. I will kill them all. I'm not threatening you. I'm fucking promising you. I am getting my shit on me right now. You David, fucking David what, what are you doing now? Oh, bullshit. No. Everybody dies in this house. Tonight. Everybody dies. You fucking think I'm kidding? What you'll be seeing next is a series of body-worn camera videos edited together showing the event leading up to the officer-involved shooting and immediately afterwards. Full versions of every officer's body-worn cameras will be released and available for viewing. Please understand that the following series of videos are not in chronological order. They have been edited together to demonstrate the important facets of the event. In this first clip, you will see Sergeant Maurer's body-worn camera in which the officers initially attempt to engage Mr. Litz in conversation in an effort to de-escalate the situation. David, this is the Utah Police Department. I'm going to need a phone up. Sorry, I just need a Jess, if you want to come up to the intersection here with James, oh, we got the PA going. He's got the light on right there. Well, it's his first house, so I don't know. Yeah. The second house, maybe we're coming out, they don't know what's going on. We're advising on the second house. We're advising on three. On three. This is a Marine. He's a fucking Marine. I will fuck you up, he said. Yo, oh, keep going back. Go. Get out of here. Tom, thank you for your service. This is up the exact uh, one they called, and he's uh, also at 1601 Nielsen Street. David okay. Litz. Go again. David, this way. Walk this way. Put your hand. Drop the somebody, knife. Somebody get one. You got a knife? Yep. David, drop the knife. I got. I got. Long, I got cover. Papa La, La. Less David, come here, David. We want to talk. Come here, David. Here you will hear several officers yelling at Mr. Litz to drop the knife. In the background, you will hear Investigator Jessica Dodge, a trained crisis intervention officer, as well as a trained crisis negotiation officer, attempting to engage Mr. Litz in dialogue. Drop the knife! Drop the knife! Drop the knife! We got time. Don't, don't. Listen, All right. Stay calm. Okay. David. David. David, will you talk to me? Shoot, shoot, shoot. Now I'm going to get my fucking M16. 
David, listen to me for a minute. Stay out here. I watched my fucking brother get killed right out front here. And you fucking turn around and say, oh, it was an accident. David. Come on, nigga. Come on, nigga. Can you put the mic down so we can talk? You will die. You will die. David. I'm going to kill you. Can you put the mic down so we can talk? No, no, no. You see, you talk with the mic. I don't want anything to have you to do tonight. You fucking killed my brother. You officer killed my brother. What happened to your brother? Ten years ago. My car. You killed him. You fucking oh, niggers. Hey, what? what where's this? Okay. Hey, drop the knife, David. Are you drop the knife. In this following clip, body-worn camera footage from Officer Gill will be seen. You will hear officers attempting to verbally engage Mr. Litz and his responses. David, we can see you. All right, just come out with your hands up. We just want to have a conversation with you. We want to help you, David. We don't want to hurt you or anything like that. Just... In the next seconds, you will witness the officer-involved shooting of David Litz. You will see Litz approach the officers with a knife prior to the shooting. Put the knife down. The knife down. Put 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 the knife down. In this clip, you will view Sergeant Goldstein's body-worn camera. You will hear him request a less-than-lethal shotgun. This particular weapon fires less-lethal beanbag rounds. Go get the less-lethal out of one of the supervisor cars, now. Additionally, you will hear gunshots from the two officers that fired their weapons. Following the shooting, the officers approached Mr. Litz to secure his hands into handcuffs to ensure no further threat existed, and then to render life-saving measures. Furthermore, the knife Mr. Litz was holding is then secured. Shots fired! Shots fired! Party down! Where's the knife? Where's the knife? 
Oh, we got shots fired. We need USC immediately. You good? I'm good. Put your hand. Put your hand. Anyone hit? Back up. Everybody back up. Back up. All right, where's he hit? Where's he hit? Where's he hit? Sergeant Goldstein instructs the officers to obtain the required go bags containing medical supplies from the patrol units. Get a go bag. I don't know. Someone get it. I'm Someone getting a go bag. Yeah. I'm just going to get it. He's got it. Who's, somebody's got it. Who's got somebody's got it. Right All right. Heavy MS come in. Don't 40 on command to right. squad commander's radio. office. Okay. I get the radio. You know the deal. Multiple GSWs. I can't see. I see the right here's one. Who's got gloves? Who's got gloves? Gloves, give me gloves. Stop hanging out with the rest of them. Watch our backs right now. I got you. I got you. I got you. Just making sure you copied all that. One party down. Trying to attend to them. Ian Messers are now right now. You haven't copied anything yet. You repeat? I got it. I got it. I got it. David. Talk to us. CPR is initiated on Mr. Litz by Investigator Femia. Where's our CPR? Start CPR. Go ahead. Start go ahead. I got it. I got it. I got it. I got you. Got it. Everybody back up. In the final clip, you will see Officer Gonzalez's body-worn camera view. The video has been slowed down to show the officer-involved shooting. Put the knife down. 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 Put the knife down! Put the knife down, Tim! Put the knife down! Put the knife down! Put the knife, get the knife! Get back! Back up! 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 